Let's move on. Let's take um, a hard. It could be too hard, but go ahead, Christine. No. You got your um your question for us. Oh yeah. So I did have a question. So say if um you go out and I've read it somewhere. I think it was a shade room. Again, shout out to the shade room. I love the shade room. <laughs> but um, so I've read it and it said this guy had wrote or he had posted something, and he said that he took a lady out. And, you know, first time date and stuff like that. And they were having a good time. And then at the end of the date, she was like, oh, well, can you buy my kids some food? Uh, wait, wait. I want to add to that. <laughs> they were also so at PF would, Chang. So how do I mean, like, well, so and then, OK, so let me go back. So he said that he said no. Basically, he told her no, mm-hmm. and she called her attitude. Like, she got she, mad at him she, for that. And after that, he said the day was awkward. They ended up, you know, just, like, not really saying that much afterwards. And then he dropped her off. Yeah. So how do y'all feel about that? Was he wrong, or was she wrong for asking? Do you asking? want the man and the female perspective? Um, yeah, like, do you want us to answer course. from both sides of our point of view? Uh-huh. Um, I think that she was wrong for asking him to buy food for her. This is she their first wrong. date? Yeah. Yeah, so it was the first date. Uh-huh. She was wrong for that. Like, she should have waited maybe a, a, a couple of days later or something. Maybe after So would you consider that, right like, from a woman's perspective, would you consider that a red flag? From a woman's perspective? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, he not I willing did. to buy my kids food. On the first date? I'm not, if no. I was a guy, I'm not buying your kids no food. So no. I don't know your kids. You should have fed your goddamn kids before you came with this motherfucking date. So, no. That's I'm not, not That's not shit. from a... That's from a female perspective. I ain't buying them kids. You gonna so on your first on the first day you gonna buy a, 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 a some food for the girl kids. Uh depends on how much and I like her. And it's kids with the net. It depends on, on how much day. I like her. Mm-hmm. That's she, true. Fuck that. You should have fed your kids. I and think it depends she, on. She didn't. I don't think she uh-huh. had no fucking kids at home. She had a man at home. She was bringing that food to her man. I don't think trying that to was cover it. it up. I don't think that. Was um, it. Kitty, you want to answer next or you want me to go? <laughs> Why did God be that? Um, I think that it's a, it's, it's a, it, not every size fit all model, if that mm. makes any sense at all. It depends on the chemistry. It depends right. on what's going on. It depends on if you all had conversations exactly. before you even went on a That's first date. Is this your first time meeting him? Exactly. Have y'all been talking for a couple of weeks or a month or so? Right. Do he know you? Do he know that you have kids? Right. Do you know him? And you, and you honestly don't know everyone's situation. Exactly. I feel like personally, I wouldn't have asked him to to buy my child any food to go, but I have been on a date where I was eating and I was like, damn, I should probably take Carmen back something to eat. Right. Yeah, exactly. Right. And like at the end, I'll say, hey, you know, can I get this, 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 that and to go? And he'd pay for it, but I wouldn't, like, I got money. I don't expect you to, you know, provide for my child because that's right. my child. But when you do, when you take that initiative to actually take an interest in my child and know that she is at home, you're going to get that. Home, she you just won. Won. Like, you that just did. got that's extra why. points. Right. That's why I now, said. Now, if you did, absolutely it's going to be in the back of my head. Like, hmm, I wonder why he didn't offer. What's going on with that? And again, it depends mm-hmm. on if we've been talking. Like, maybe it's I just pain. went out with you and he probably like, bitch, I'm just trying to fuck. And I'm just like, I'm just trying to eat for free. So you just never know, you know? Exactly. Um, I definitely agree with Kitty. Um, First of all, I would never ask you on a first date or probably not even the second date to buy a meal for my child. However, I will order the food for my child and be like, you know, I'll pay for this separate or something like that. And if you offer, of course, I'm going to be like, okay, go ahead. But I'm not going to, I'm not going to be like, Hey, can you buy my kids something to eat? Right. No. And especially if we have more of the date to go on. Right. Like, no, we can probably stop and get your kids something on the way. Right. Or something like that. But why are we going to get them PF chain? It's going to be nasty and cold by the time we get home two hours from now. And what time is it? I'm pretty sure your kid's going to be asleep. You get it? Like, it's a lot of things that goes yeah, on. Um, but, and the, the, the person on the date, they don't know your kids. So, and they're, and they're not trying to impress your kids just yet. Well, and they should your, be. I feel your, like. If it's your first date. 
Nine times out of ten, you don't know the person's kids. Well, no, listen. Yeah, but if you, can, you talk like, about them, like I talk about my child, if I'm mm-hmm. having conversations, like I talk child, about my babies too. So. She she comes up all the time. We could be talking about like, and if I if I meet somebody I new, I think that it's just like mandatory that I tell them. Like, yeah, I like to tell. I have a baby, and not even I, like I talk about her. Not like, even like a baby, but it's like because I don't want you to come in my space and be like, oh shit, that's like a baby. Like I have a five month year old. He just turned five. Five five month year old. old. I have a five month old baby. Okay, I have a five month (laughs) old baby, and it's like if I meet somebody, it's like whoa, like that's a whole baby, you know? Yeah, it really, it really from an actual male's perspective, it really just depends. You know what I mean? Because maybe you like like uh, Keely said, maybe if you know or you mention. Throughout the you yeah my I have kids at home or something like that and the guy's like you know what we out eating nice you like you want you know if he offers but if it, it like I said it all depends on how it's going because if a girl just asks me and I'm like hold up I don't really know you then you not getting nothing but if if I know you and you be vibing and it's cool you know maybe and how many kids are we talking about and it, well fuck that I ain't buying no kids. No, I'm not buying your kids. It, I'm kids. saying it depends. No, what's my intentions? What's my intentions with you? Kids, but so. what's my intention with you? If, am am right. I intending to be around these little right. junks or, or what? You know what I'm saying? If if these are my intentions, then yeah, I t- like if I'm gonna be around your kids, I take care like take care of the babies. Right. You always take care of the babies. So maybe that's what that wasn't his intentions because he said after that it was just like Probably a wrap. Yeah, well, I mean, or you don't, or he don't know him. You don't even know what, what the situation. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's so many layers to it. Who knows what she said? It's not always what you say. It's how you. Yeah, because you. We don't know if she when they order their food, she tried to order her kids to. Everybody know you supposed to order that to go at the end of the meal. Yeah, it's you it, know it's just it, it's a pain. Did she depends. already buy the fifty dollars steak and you know it, stuff yeah, like? It definitely depends. Yeah, like if you went over your limit, no, I'm not. Going so to get that's that's a good question. So when y'all go out, don't like, take me on the date if I got a limit. Order? That's what I'm, I'm saying. talking that's, about. That's like, why we don't go on dates. Like, no. I'm, go not, I'm not. I'm not you I know dates, you do. I do. Fuck you that. When y'all go on the on the first date or I any order date, you order whatever. Hey, you want, come Yeah, what do y'all order on the I first order date? Lorraine what? does that. She orders the most expensive thing that she would not normally order. Why do y'all do that? Ain't no y'all. I don't do that. I'll know. be like, oh, let me get this fifteen dollars for right. a meal. I do not go and get no twenty. How, how would you, know, you do it? How would you I'm do not it? paying myself. It depends on what I got a taste for. I'm not that type that's just like, oh, I'm about to get order lobster and champagne mm. just because he's taking me on a date. If I got a taste <laughs> for a salad or a burger or a steak, that's just what I got a taste for. I get a drink though. Oh, that's gonna that's, be that's the most one thing that I do. Right, things. I do get a drink, and it just depends if I want like. A fruity strong drink, or if I want some wine, if I want steak and wine, or if so I want do, a fucking beer and burger. Do y'all What's really? Do y'all think? Do y'all re- does it go through your? Because you said you go for the expensive thing. It goes through your like head. I'm I'm trying I'm trying to get the most expensive thing. I'm gonna see if you're gonna like pay for expensive it. Expensive shit. I, that's I fine. Like I'm fine. That's cool. I'm just saying. Is and it? Is it? I like steak depending on if I'm eating meat. That if if it is a thing where you oh I'm gonna see what this guy sometimes. got. Sometimes it's or, not. Yes. That's not with me it's more of a, it is. i'm out and i have the liberty to order whatever i want i'm <laughs> gonna live i'm gonna eat this shit and i'm not gonna just get one drink i want like three of these motherfuckers so the after ordering the lobster and all of this stuff uh is uh sex implied no so suppose he didn't bring enough money for bullshit. both meals i'm asking the question I always do that. Too. I always take my own money. I always take money. I think that's bullshit at what you just said because I remember vaguely a time when fuck shit me and when soon as me and fuck shit like started talking back again. And I was like, so he hit me up and he was like, you know, like hotel, strawberry, wine, woo, woo. Oh, woo. Yeah. And I, I was both. like, yes. And I text him back and I was like, I want some Moet. And he was like, okay. And this bitch was like, don't do that. 
you don't drink Moet. You drink Andre. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I'm thinking, and I'm like, you know what? I don't want to come off that way, but I got a taste for Moet. So I text him, and I was like, Moet. And he was like, well, you know what? I don't have, he was like, I already got, no, I forgot what he said. But anyways, he bought some Ciroc or whatever, and it was the big bottle and shit. And I was just like, all right, we could drink that. So, like I said, when I first started, it's no one size fit all, like I said. And the difference mm-hmm. between what I just said about me going on a date and ordering the expensive shit because I want to live is because when I go on a date, I go on a date with no feelings attached. You had a, a intention to making that boy your boyfriend. You wanted him. That's not true. At that time, that was not so you, true. You, you, that you, wasn't true. You don't go, you go on a date like, fuck these niggas. Yes. So is it is she it like so lots and lots and lots is it wrong? <laughs> is, is it, but I have been on a date with some guys who I really wanted, you know. Right, that's to, what I'm to, saying. Is it wrong? So is it wrong for if if that's cool, right? Yeah. Is it wrong for a guy to just go just to try to have sex? Then? Absolutely not. Okay, it's not wrong. Just like you know, if I order lobster or shrimp or whatever I order, and he'd be like, listen, I wasn't even trying to pay all of that. I always bring my own money. That's our last date. You just bought our last date and it's never going to happen. Damn! Again. But I could buy my own food, and that's your choice. Now, so if, if I if I don't got enough to buy whatever you feel like eating, then I can't date you. That's our last date. You shouldn't have invited me out. And, at the same token, if you Ooh, if we go out and you want to fuck after, I might want to fuck out too like it's not like oh i don't fuck on the first what if what if i'm trying to fuck before we eat um, fuck no i don't trust you because then you ain't buy me no damn food I mean, I, I, never had that so damn huh? I never had that experience before. So oh, I, you ain't never had a nigga try to fuck with it's like, damn, let's uh I got a bottle on You cut that shit off. I never like, had it. Oh, oh the that, date is canceled. But I, I do have a question, Kitty. Are you so I'm cutting good? you off? <laughs> yes, um, it's requ- so, it's levels to this shit. So suppose right? Kitty, right? So like you said you might go on a date tonight, right? Right. So suppose the first is Tuesday, so rent is due. Right. And suppose y'all go on a date and the guy's like, you know, hey, before y'all even get started, he's like, hey, you know, I, we're going to go to this restaurant, but I only have $60. Can we try to keep it at this? Because <laughs> rent is due on, on Tuesday. Right. You know, our next day to be better. Would you still? I would tell him we don't need to go to that restaurant. I would tell him we could do something that don't require a lot of money. Chipotle. It, it, we don't even ice cream. Got to do Chipotle. We can make some. I'm food asking, is Chipotle cool? To the wharf, or we could go to the navy yard. It's nice outside. We where, where, have a picnic. Where, where, oh, where is it? All the Smithsonian museums are free. Where, I got all the cheap dates. What, what is acceptable to take you on the first date? If it's a date, I don't even know what dates are. But anyway, if it's a date, what's acceptable restaurant to take me? One is not too loud. A date is you going to go out. You're courting me. Um, That's a date. It, Courtney. Right. It, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it doesn't necessarily have to be a restaurant My because name. I'll take creativity <laughs> over um, <laughs> expense yeah. any day. Yeah. Like, you don't have to take me to a restaurant. We can go do some like nice, fun shit. Like, we could go to a festival and you could say, hey, boo, we about to stop at this store. I need you to pack all this shit in your purse what if, so we could get it in. What if I say, like, I just ordered this new sex swing? And I'm trying to test it out. I'm with the shit. I like on the first date. It depends. Did I just meet him? Because I just ordered this music. First day. I've had. Well, no, not a first date, but I've had a sex a a sex date. A second (laughs) date at a sex club, and and we knew off bat like that's both what we were into, so it wasn't really a big deal. So it depends. I don't know. Were we talking before you told me about your sex swing? Like, I like sex swings and shit. You're not into sex swings? What you into? You want to do missionary? No, I'm not born. I'm not born at all. She humps back, she said. It got to be like a chemistry. I can't. I'm not the type of person that could just, like, have sex without feelings attached. You never seen a guy been like, I want to, I want to. Especially if it's like we're, we're like, kind of like somewhat partners. Mm -hmm. Like. You mine, nigga. You never it's seen mine. nobody that you wanted yes. to uh, rip their clothes off? <laughs> I mean, of course, but it's like, do I rip their clothes off? But no. if they would have said... Can we have a conversation? What's wrong with having conversations? It, What's wrong with like... What's wrong with nothing real, real hard over it, and over again? It's nothing over wrong Over and with over again. again. Real, real over and over, over again. again. It's nothing wrong with it at all. Shit, I'm like, but get to the shit. I want to like know you. 
Can we know nah, each other? Man, you know. I feel you. Call when you want. And that's just because it makes that type of person. Like I can't. Like I, I want to go to the sex houses and stuff like that, but I'm just not that type of person that's about to be like. Unless maybe I'm like real fucked up. But won't you go like and that? don't participate? Yeah, no, I'm saying. I've been to plenty. I don't participate. Right, and it's like I want to go, but I don't see myself participating. It depends. Mm-hmm. It's not a no. it's not an all situation type thing. It depends. Mm-hmm. Is Chipotle acceptable? I love Chipotle. Absolutely. On a first date. Chipotle and ice cream is only date. like we going to get 15 burritos. But they have a lunch date. I can have, yes. I have me a bowl. We could do Chipotle can we go, and a picnic. Can we That'd take it fine. in? Right. Go to, we could take a... Go to the park, sit on a blanket, and eat it. I love to eat it. Mm-hmm. Oh, we can find a bitch oh, yeah. outside. Like, it's a lot what of What is your definition of a date? Do. What is a date? Since you, you're in the background saying shit. I don't know. I'm asking. I don't know. Because you don't date? No, I, I guess I go out meeting with people and stuff. Like, I don't know what's it. Is that a date if is I go out? If so, if I go out and eat with you, then we went on a date. Yeah, okay. if there's somebody that's not in your friend zone, like if you go out to eat with me, then no, obviously that's not a date because me and you are friends. I mean, you We're can have family. dates with your friends, though. I have dates with my it friends. It just depends on if it's an intimate date or not. But it's like, still what's a your, date. Yeah, what's so your intention? What's an intimate date? You mean if it's uh, sex intimate implied? Day is like whole and hands. Like you and Reese are obviously not about to be whole and hands with y'all Chipotle mm. and shit. <laughs> it's just like, you know, it's it's... It's the vibe. It's the chemistry. Okay. So it's like if y'all online and you all up, you know, on her, hugging on her and shit like that. Oh, they on a date. So if we go get Chipotle and I hug you in line, that's a date. <laughs> if you holding on if to you're her like extra and, you know, rubbing on thighs you know, and booties and hips. Yeah. Yes. Like, bae, I got you. Lower Even back shoulders. action. Like, yeah. You know, yeah. shit like that. Right. It's a date. Y'all and we going to go to this park. And we right. want to sit down and eat this Chipotle. Yes. Yeah. And when, and when people say that they don't have money so to go cute. out on a date, it's really an excuse now. You can Chipotle. go to $20 to fuck up shoppers and have a picnic and like it's totally fucking fine. Sandwiches. Or like even if you the invite the person pie. over, don't just have, oh, my couch is here. We're going to watch TV and eat some chips. No. Put a blanket out. Light some candles. Make it yes. cute. Make it cute. Be creative. Dollar Tree has every fucking thing. They have those little play candle hold things. On, on. They what? have roses. If if y'all went on the first date and someone's like, yeah, come over, hang out. I'm not whatever. having a first date in your house. No. <laughs> oh, you okay. You're not having a first date. No. Okay. I'm not. But you can't. So Even, uh, like, With a bitch, I'm not having a first when, date at your house. When is it acceptable to have the person over? No, or ask them to come over there. If I if I don't feel like leaving out, uh, I, I guess that depends on the person too. Because I'm just not about to just have anybody coming over. Like I really gotta fuck with you or like no, you. Come, come, or, or you go, you go, you go, go. Or for me to go over there. Because I know eventually you want us being around each other. You gonna try something. So I really gotta like like you. What you mean? You gonna try something? I don't understand. Put that arm around and look at you in your eyes and shit. Try to get closer and shit. You know what's the mood? So what type of mood? Depends on how I feel. If I want you in my house or if I don't. I mean, you could say. Like a not a I, I'm saying. So say like house, you so. would go to a guy's house. The guy was like, "Oh, come over. You know, we're gonna hang out. Whatever." Whoop de whoop. No. And he had like decorations I, and shit up. That y'all would like that. What? Deco- what is decorations? Fuck like she was saying. Candles and rose candles petals. Rose. What? Fuck yeah. Or oh, he got a nice ass house and he got like a patio and he got like lights and shit up. How your and patio? You go, oh, yeah. Remember when and me you and Ronnie like, had a picnic down like there? He got music and shit playing. You're just like, oh, you, you want some? <laughs> I'm about to fuck you. Don't let him have a pool too. Like that's just. Or that's jacuzzi just shit. Oh, we can make you naked. Like what we doing? Listen. What you do? Take Listen, those off. Linda. Listen. Yeah. All right. It all depends. It depends on the case. It depends, yeah. And it depends on how you saying come over. You yeah. like them, you don't like them, um, you want to fuck them, you don't want to fuck them. It really depends. Even soon? if you want to fuck them, like me, I usually do. I be like, don't fuck them. So mm-hmm. I'm not coming over your house because I know if I come over your house, I think my bad already be made up like within like the second day or some shit. Fuck if second I'm a fucking day, one. I know day one if you getting fucked or not. Do y'all like, check maybe guys like the second up? day because day one is like, oh, he cute. You know, I can try to imagine like, is it big or small? You know, can day he one, kiss? I'm like, a kisser. Yeah. Can he <laughs> kiss? You know, is he nice? Like, just trying to get his vibe. And then the second day, it's like if he just say anything or just I'm just not feeling it no more. It's like, all right, I, I probably won't fuck him. Yeah, I'm a day one. 
I don't know. I I know who I want to fuck and who I don't want to fuck. And usually I hang out with people I don't want to fuck because I know if I hang out with people I, I do want to fuck, I'm probably going to fuck them. I don't know. Well, <laughs> okay, this, but this is going to bring me into my next question. So I heard on the radio, um, I forget which station, um, earlier this week. And it was basically saying that, and I'm going to say this word wrong, mi- millennium? Millennial. Millennials. Millennials. I think it's a tongue ring. It is. I'm, I'm actually going to take out my snake bites, y'all. So RS. RVP. RIP. RIP. She said RSVP <laughs> to the event. <laughs> no more mimosas for me. No. Um, yeah, I'm going to take them out because um, it, it's really irritating. Um, but anyway, um, so they were saying that millenni- millennial men um, prefer a woman that makes more than them. Um, and they said this is a new study. They prefer a woman to make more than them because they want that woman to pay off their debt and that that is a main c- c- factor to when they're picking their mate. They want um, the woman to men, pay uh, off so millennials. Their millennials. Yeah, millennials. millennials. Um, so I would say millennials. anywhere between... Uh, you ain't no millennial. We're not. I was going to say like you're 95 not. to 2000. No, you not. Not you not. You was definitely not. You were not a millennial. Yeah, I don't think no, we're, we're not. Millennials. No, you're yeah, not. Google, but we're not. Aww. But anyway, Aww. and you saw, I think you that I don't think so. <laughs> but anyway, I think that is complete bullshit. I think it's complete bullshit. Um, why I always say that um, the man in, in that in your household should make more is because, and I've said it before. Because the woman has to go on paternity leave. You know, women in general get sick faster and stuff. So it's like if she's the breadwinner and she has to be out of work to have a baby or surgery or whatever like that, he ain't going to be able to hold down the fort. And I I know a lot of people say, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think a lot of people say, like, we're millennials. We are? Yeah, I just... No fucking millennial. I knew I was a millennial. Ain't no fucking millennial. We are. So who who that he ain't the same generation? What is he? Anybody born nineteen eighty two and above are millennials so, because we grew up in the two thousand. What, what happened? What happened to gener- What happened to Generation X? They just eliminated Generation, generation X? X. Is my mother's generation? Right. My mother is forty two or forty one. She's forty two or forty one. So as I'm saying, he's not. He, we he ain't in the same. He, he is. He, we're he in the, 22. If you grew up in the 2000s, you are a millennial. If you were born in the 2000s, then you're not a millennial. So what are they? They generation Y. They haven't generation yet. They I still think they, they still young. Our we generation, generation Y. Y'all watching Soft 30. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Click all the buttons. Click, 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 click.